Hello and welcome to the Sons of Thule. We are here uh, actually in plain knowledge right now because I have buffs and I didn't want them to expire. Uh, but uh, first things first, uh, yesterday I earned uh, 30 AA on uh, I think everybody. Yeah, I was trying to get for more, get more to try to burn off this uh, exp experience potion. Uh, but uh, I fell asleep <laughs> literally at my desk. Uh, so what I'm going to do here is uh, go ahead and pick out my AAs for uh, these guys just to get started here. So first things first, we need uh, Mystical Attuning, another rank of that. I almost feel like two ranks of that is going to be useful on him. Uh, this is the Shadow Knight. We're going to grab uh, Combat Agility, uh, Combat Stability. And then let's go can purchase. I feel like. Oh, what does this one go to? 100%. Let's go a soul abrasion for right now. And that gives us two left theft of life. Hmm, this is a tough choice. Let's get the last, uh, actually, let's go with, let's go with Theft of Life. I think that'll be beneficial. Uh, then we're going to save our Merc points. Hey, Larfin, how are you doing this evening? All right, this is the Shaman. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, it's manual, man. We, uh, we do not have the auto grant enabled, so we are, uh, we're picking and choosing, trying to see what is important to us. And uh, that is actually very hard <laughs> to pick what is actually important at this level. Um, let's see here. What is Dampen? Spirit Call. Call of the Ancients. Hmm. here spend suspend your pad hey Wallace how are you doing oh man I should have thought about the <laughs> the shamans uh, AA's a little bit more um what am I doing with him I am gonna be nuking mostly today so let's do uh second secondary forte uh, first of all, because he's uh, currently forteed into uh, special specialized into um, evoke, so we'll do that. Um, let's grab spirit call, which gives us the uh, more uh, pets. This is only like two, so let's get a few ranks of that. That'll give us some more swarm pets. And we're going to go Fury of Magic. Uh, let's do quick damage. That'll make our spell casting a little bit faster. We have 10 points left. Let's grab... What am I... What heal am I using? Heal over time. So we're going to go with... Uh, healing Boon. Grab one rank of that. And uh, we have seven left. Let's grab a Mystic Attuning. And... Let's go with... Destructive Fury. There we go. And I'll go improve mana for the bar or for that. And then for the Bard, this is even even harder uh because i have no idea what i want so let's go let's get boastful bellow here that's active 199 so let's do alt act 199 that'll give her a little bit of damage into this whole operation here and then I got a notification for my own event from Discord. <laughs> uh, let's see here. Good. Glad, glad, glad you're doing good, man. Um, 
So I'm not doing much with the bard except for singing songs. Let's pick up a rank of that. Let's pick up a rank of that. Times two. I think that is going to be... The buff slots has really become quite a uh, limiting factor for a lot of things. Um, oh, there we go. We got some mass, uh, some focus we can actually get on the bard. Um, I think instrument mastery. Let's do instrument mastery there. Jam fest. Let's do a jam fest and. I should have done singing mastery instead of that, but that'll be fine. And let's just go with foot. There we go. And we need to save hers for the uh, Merc. All right. There we go. That took a little longer than I thought. But first things first, we're going to head off to Bastion of Thunder. Uh, we're not going to do the level 60. We're going to do the level 65 quest. Knock that out real fast. Then we're going to head off to uh, Stone Root Falls and try out that expansion. I... I don't think I've done anything in those expansion that uh, Depths of Dark Hollow uh, on any of these recent characters. Hey, uh, Icky Cake Z, how are you doing? Or Ikey, Ikey Cake Z. Oh, that's that's gonna irk me. <laughs> how are you doing this evening? All right. Get zoned in. Come on. The bard is taking a little bit too long to get in. All right, while we're waiting on the bard, I need to, uh, I need to actually see if this buff works now. I didn't have enough buff slots before to do anything. <laughs> So there we go. Let's see if we can get cloak on us. Yeah, cloak does stack. Perfect. And we'll go back to black shroud. There we go. Now we're at uh, seventeen thousand hit points. Very nice. Very nice indeed. I don't think we have any real buffs. Uh, some beast lord came by and gave us some buffs. And I guess we have Hand of Virtue. I think that's from our Mercenary. And I guess we got Mammoth Force, whatever that is. Attack rating, so. We don't have... Oh, and we do have a... We don't have it on this character. My uh, my Bard has a Mage Damage Shield. I'm not sure. <laughs> I don't know how that happened. Uh, but, you know, that's what it is. Let's see here. You're good watching... While you play EverQuest yourself. Nice, nice. It is, uh, I don't know, it's a real fun game. I love it myself. It's good to see other people playing. What server do you play on? Alright, so this should take very little time to kill these five, uh, Kriegers. I, uh, I did it yesterday, that's how I got the 30 AA, just going through here and doing this quest. Uh, but I kind of stopped because I was uh, I didn't want to level up more. Oh, Ferona, nice, that's where, uh, that's where I'm playing. Hey, afternoon, G, how are you doing? Or <laughs> afternoon, evening, <laughs> you've, you've been said it. Oh, man. Uh, let's see here. You didn't click. Why didn't you click? There we go. Got our frogs. Come on. Oh, thanks for uh, the Prime subscription there, G. I did not just, I just noticed that. Thank you very much. I really appreciate that. All right, let's go up here. All right, looks like sand is camped. I like lightning. Uh, that's where we need to go anyway. The brands are up in this direction anyway. Well, I'm 
I'm glad you enjoy it. I'm, uh, I try my best to make, make the best I can. <laughs> it's, uh, I spent, uh, spent, spent a lot of time working on these, so I'm glad, uh, oh, I'm not marked as, uh, I'm glad people are enjoying the content and, uh, really? There we go. It is working out fairly well. Let's just send everything to her. Uh, let's go over here, this one. Slow him. Nice, nice. I'm, I'm, I'm glad it inspired you to get back into the game. Hey, that is like that is like the best thing in the world, right? More people playing is uh, great for the game. Uh, it's just fantastic. <sighs> Original art in the uh, Nome Regard house. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, I think I put all the all the paintings in no, the Gnome Regard house. Uh, I, I'm trying to figure out what happens to my houses if I move servers. Because I want to move Gnome Regard to uh, Frona Vi. And uh, I like I, re I reserved his name and everything. Uh, so I was like, I can I can move him over, but what happened? Do I have to like pre-pack up all the houses and all that stuff and all that little stuff? Yeah, the game can get very overwhelming, uh, for sure. But, uh, you just gotta... Just take, take your time, and, uh... Don't worry about it too much. And, uh... You're gonna... If you have any questions on the, uh, IS Boxer stuff, let me know. Um... Uh, I'm, I'm sure I missed something in my explanation, right? Since I've had it set up for like three years <laughs> and I think at this point and so what I I might I might gloss over something not even thinking about it all right or of hate what does that do did that do Yeah, yeah. The the private server stuff is is pretty fun, but I I'm I'm a sucker for live. I don't know. Uh, it's just it's so li so limiting, right? On the private server, you can only go to like uh, like gate, uh, Omens of War, I think. Maybe they added another one now, but it's uh, it's just not the same game, I think. Yeah, uh, the, I, I'll post a screen, if you're on the Discord, I'll post a screenshot of how I have my windows laid out. Uh, actually, let me see. Let me see what's on my screen right now. And I'll show you kind of what, uh, what it looks like, and it might make sense. Let's see here, print screen. Photoshop. Oh, all right, I'll let that load in the background. Oh, there's a group right there. Uh, get past them. All right, so is this the teleporter room? No. It's so crazy. This server is like so different than what I'm used to, right? On Bristlebane, I can go through like every single zone, and it's like I'm literally playing on a private server. Uh, but here on uh, this server, it is literally like uh, like a real server. Come on, clipboard, create spoilers for the upcoming content. <laughs> All right, paste. There we go. So. 
you can kind of see it here. Um, like here's the main window in the middle and then uh, the two sub windows are here and I just click on this and it switches it to this window like so. And uh, it works pretty well, uh, pretty well for me. I, I don't need much more than that, right? It does the uh, the repetition of the keys to the, each window and stuff like that. So that makes it, you know, pretty easy in that regard. But like, uh, it's just a matter of getting used to like, you have to go kind of go like this if you have a melee on auto follow. And I could probably, I could probably do some melee classes with this combo and make sure they're on auto follow the same way. And they would uh, definitely be successful. Go. Oh, you know what? I, I've been going this whole time without mercs. That's hilarious. I just noticed that. <laughs> oh, man. There we go. Go snare that one. Not snare, but uh, that's what I wanted. Let's get this guy. What level's that? 60. So these are starting to get to. Uh... Yeah. <laughs> like, like literally on Bristlebane, my whole my whole leveling up experience, I rarely saw a single. A single person until I got to current content and uh, on this server I think every single zone I've gone to I've experienced seeing people in one form or another and it's not like people power leveling people it's like literal real people in groups or box groups it's crazy it's something uh, hopefully they take maybe it's the free trade that makes this server so popular Maybe they need to take that into account on the next TLP, make it free trade. I don't think I would want to go back to normal after this. All right, so we need to go to the fire tower, which I'm always forgetting which one it is. It's this one. I know, right? They should announce it earlier so people can plan what they want to do. There we go. Clicky you up. Clicky you. Come on. Really? I'm not sure why that guy attacked, but that's interesting. don't know what happened there. Alright, well, it de -aggroed. Uh, Maybe he had auto-attack on us. Let's, let's see. Assist. Off. I don't want him to melee anymore. It's causing more issues than I'd like. Alright, get a slow. Come on, slow. There we go. There's a, if you go to the TLP form on the uh, official forums uh, on everquest.com, there's a big thread about people not wanting a uh, Gates of Discord start. And then there's another one with uh, people praising it. So <laughs> uh, it'll be interesting to see what, what they end up going with. There's one, here's number two. 
but if, if it's not a boxing server, I'm probably going to do a paladin. Uh, and if it's a boxing server, I'm going to do a paladin, enchanter, druid. That's my, my current plans to do, uh, do for this TLP. I, I'm kind of, I'm kind of burned out on, uh, Shadow Knights. Since I'm doing, uh, two different series now with, uh, Shadow Knights, I didn't really plan that very well. Oh, more shoulders we can't do anything with. There we go. I see one frog. There he is. I was like, where's the other frog? Mine's on passive, though. Why is mine on passive? Yeah, that'd be... That would be disappointing if they don't do, uh, if they do, do a, um, non-classic start, if you're trying to get your kids and stuff to go through it with you. There we go. Let's do it. Oh. Need to move that to an actual button, should I? Probably put it like right there. Actually, what we should probably do. We need a new hockey. This is DOA1, so let's do this. Where's my spam button? Where is it? There it is, spam. So let's make a spam two and let's deal with these guys real quick. Yeah, I, I hold down right mouse button with uh, and then hit WASD so I can uh, kind of circle strife around. That's why I play in uh, third person. Oh, got a three for. All right. There we go. Get. How's mana? Mana is great, actually. Why am I even concerned about that? Let's switch to this one. Here, let's do Soul Guard. Lower some damage here. That one's slowed, and then there is a third one over there. That needs to get a slow on him. And we should be able to face tank them all once the slow lands. Didn't land. We did lose one here. I want slow on this guy, please. That's hilarious. Reactive. My, uh, I was. He hasn't needed healing this entire time because uh, the healer was on uh, passive. There we go. And slow's about to wear off on this guy. Let's try to refresh that. Never mind. Okay, we finished that. Uh, we don't need this gear anymore. Gotten enough of it. So I'm going to uh, take what I know sells in the auction house because I did make like 10,000 platinum over the uh, last few days selling this uh, intricate gear on the auction house and uh, selling the spells you get from this is uh, also worth doing 
So we're going to finish up here and then zone out to uh, head to uh, Stoho Falls next. Ah, okay. Yeah, I, I, f I find that's the best way to play, right? I, my, my personal fa favorite view for a video game is the MMO, quote unquote, style camera, where uh, the, 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 the character is in third person, but centered on the screen. Kind of like how I have him set up right now. Uh, I can't stand that right next to the back of their head, third person that some games do. It just drives me insane. But, uh, oh, what's that? I like this, this more MMO style. I think WoW does it probably the best because you, you can still do the, you know, the free rotate and then you can, uh, in EverQuest, you can right click and face the direction that you want to uh, go. So it works out really well for me. All right, three. Slowed. Oh. All right, let's just do this. Let's just. All right, you need to have your thing moved over here. Optimize that so we can actually get slow off instead of him chain nuking. There we go. Come on. <laughs> Strictly first person. Uh I've seen I've seen some uh, YouTube videos where people are in first person, and I I'm just not sure how they can play like that. Like I like to be able to see everything that's going on. But I, I played a uh, I played tanks in World of Warcraft for so long that I like having the camera zoomed out as far as I can, where I can see everything, so I can kind of know what's going on on the battlefield, right? Yeah, I guess you could. I guess the immersion factor. You're right. One down. This one did slow. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's a little I don't know. I I don't I don't feel as immersed as I would in like Skyrim or something like that. go all right is that everybody all right we cleared the floor okay so to get the stone root uh, we need to get back to plane of knowledge so let's go ahead and do that first <laughs> staring at a bunch of giant blue legs yeah so we're at uh, 10 AA now, so we should be able to buy a few things here soon. I'm going to change all their experience to, uh, to uh, the opposite, right? So I want 10% AA and I want to level up now and get to 70. There we go. So you follow me. Turn on your songs. Hey, J Hammy SLC, how are you doing this evening? All right. So we need to go. I think neck. Uh, yeah, neck, nectos, nectulus forest to Chorus Keep, which will send us. Where is that? Here. And then we gotta go undershore to Stone Root Falls. So that's pretty. Pretty good. And we need to go to the evil side of town. Uh, 
Wow, there's a lot of uh, a lot of tents over here. Nice. The st the steins are so useful. There we go. I did click everybody over. Check to los. Come on. There we go. To everybody doing their job here. Let's get her singing and we just need to go straight across. Uh, I think these are the normal armor colors. Oh, where is it? Die. Yeah, that's the normal. Normal colors. It's uh, pretty, pretty epic. Like a circus clown. <laughs> Let's see here. Scroll down just a little bit over here. Oh yeah, wait, wait, hold on. Before I do anything else, I want to set the spam button up. So do DOA one for taunt. Uh, then cast seven. Or of hate. And I think that'll be better because I have five bounded dots for. Uh, for the shaman, so I kind of want those to be spammed. Really? Can I not attack him? Oh, he's a quest mob. <laughs> All right. Let's get into the water here. All right, gotta go slow. She has zero swimming. That's interesting. Let's see if we can pop our way through here. did not go hello stasis 316 how are you doing we're headed to stone root falls today stone root falls is from the depths of dark hollow expansion and i don't think i've spent any time there uh, other than a few daily quests with my uh, necromancer so this is going to be some some fresh content <laughs> Right. Everybody's here. We'll see how this works. Stuff is uh, green, so can keep going here. Where do we? Where do we need to go? We need to go to Undershore, which is right over there. I guess we can go this way. Just fight anything along the way. I think it'll be fine. We want to follow the river right here, so kind of the way we want to go. This guy got stuck on a shroom. Let's do this real quick. I don't need haste at the moment. Oh, nice. 54, you're getting 5% a kill in uh, Vexar. Wow. I mean, uh, Greg's End. Wow. Oh, nice. You got some laptops coming for you. Stasis, that's good. You gonna... You gonna true box on the new server? Or, uh... 
what what, do you, what are your plans um and i would say vexar is a good place to go um just depends on uh how far you can stretch that five percent i don't know if you'll get much better than that anywhere else All right, just a little bit further down this windy maze of shroomery. Really? As you can see, the uh, shaman is doing his own thing here. All right, we're almost there. And uh, let's take the legit zone right here and not the uh, jump off the waterfall zone. I don't have levitate on. <laughs> yeah, I, I feel the I feel the heat also for my wife when I when I go all in on something. Okay, you'll be boxing a 30-year group. Nice. Okay. So, we're here in uh, Undershore. Stone Root Falls is just across the zone, so we're going to try. Where the hell is the Shaman? Where is he? All right, the shaman went way over here. Um, so let's go. Let's go save the shaman. I don't know what happened there, but uh, <laughs> where is he? He should be like right here. There he is. There we go. As the druid ring, so we want to just go straight across the map. Oh, and we're getting attacked by hog uh, snakes, I guess. Oh my gosh, we got a we got a lot of mobs on us. All right, we're going to have to in, uh, invis up here. They're all light blue, but this is going to be a little bit of a, a cluster. And this snake is like literally going around grabbing people to come fight us. Starving Corthassus. Mercenaries are off killing something, I guess. This is fun. What's the... Is the experience any good? 21? There we go. Where are they? Oh, they just killed... Whatever that is. Oh, thank you very much, Stasis, for the Amazon Prime uh, subscription. I really appreciate that. I truly do. There we go. This one. All right, we got our we got our mercenaries back. This should go a little faster now. I don't know what they were doing before. Oh, that's an AUG. Oh, nice. Uh, that's got wisdom, so let's send that there. Everything else can go to uh, Miss Stockholm, our trader. What is this? A fragile bottle? Looks like something I don't really want to carry around.
And that is another undershore fungus. We'll send that to me. He's attacking with melee again. Wasn't too bad. They just got a lot more hit points than uh, normal stuff. So we can kind of. All right, there's snakes in the water. So <laughs> I just realized that's not going to be a, a good idea. Um. So it's a straight shot. Like that. There's land on the other side of this thing. So we need to get over there. Let's try this out here. Stop going. Underwater. Oh, okay, we got like three mobs on us now. Just gonna go. Don't wanna. I don't wanna fight in the water. Let's see if we can get over that this land over here. these con these are indifferent so we don't have to worry about these shrooms attacking us should be fine all right oh my gosh all right we're at, we're at the we're at the zone line anyway Oh, come on. Can't, uh, I can't control the shaman, so hopefully he's fine. Come on. Give me, <laughs> give me control of somebody. I hate these uh, zones where it locks up everything. This is a very long zone time too. There we go. <laughs> oh God. Oh good, it's water. <laughs> Oh man. Is everybody in? Alright, everybody's in. No one's drowning except the bard. Let's fix that. There we go. Jeez, that was a uh interesting experience. There's some kind of little lag on the server too moment. There we go. Crunchy skin. I'm gonna send that to her anyway because it's lore. Just to uh, prevent that. What are we killing here? We're killing spider? No, this isn't. This is stone root. So we need to find spiders in this zone. Let's get out of the water. Uh, otherwise we're just gonna get Whoa. Oh, it's like a raid, uh, a raid lizard over there. Oh, uh, that's crazy. All right. Why are you at the, like the bottom of the water here? I'm trying to drown. Jeez. I think the spiders are over here. Or over here. One of those, the hive, I think, is where, where we want to go. So let's go down this way. What is this guy, Khan? Okay. He's dubious, so we don't have to worry about him. 
see if we can get... Oh, they're up top? Alright. Let's see if we can get out of the water first. Alright, we'll let the mercenaries fight that. Two rogues can kill a light blue, I hope. That guy doesn't like us. Okay, where can we go here? The Drained Captain. These are even con. Let's uh, let's try one of these. See how good they are for experience real quick. So we're at 30%. Go, uh, send that to her. She can't loot it anyway. All right, thirty percent. Slowed. Let's see if we can get a dot on him. He's got some hit points. There we go. So this is a hot zone in addition to all the other experience bonuses going on. We got 2% for him, so that's not bad. That looks like a trade item. Oh, shoot. All right, we got this, we got this. Come on, slow. One by one, we get these things slow here. Come on. Do your job, Shaman. Snare and slow. Snare and slow. He is needs one. You might be able to stay there then even longer, uh, J Hammy. If it's still uh, red and yellow, I would, I would stay until it's blue. Uh, because you you're gonna want to, the higher you get, you're gonna want to be able to kill, kill mobs faster, right? Okay, we lost aggro on like every single one of these guys. That healer is just taking so much damage. One down. There we go. This one. Can't get snare on him. There we go. Perfect. Still can't taunt him off, though. Who are you hitting? You're, like, beating the poor cleric to death, man. There we go. Bottom left of the map, like right here, where this says the hive. Perfect. Thank you, Wallace. If there's still uh if there's still red to you, J Hammy SLC, you could probably keep going to like sixty. I would say it would probably be beneficial. And if since you're using auto grant, you should get fairly uh 
fairly strong off that because the I would say the ideal mobs for killing for experience is going to be the things you can kill the fastest to get the most amount uh, of kills in a, in a single time. There we go. Slow. Alright, so we just need to go around the corner here and then I guess go through wherever that is, a gate. And we should get to where we need to be. Good. All right, looks like there is a, some adventurers here. And there's the Drachnids. There we go. All right, so they're right over here. We're going to go. We're going to go around, hopefully. Hopefully. Shaman. Silly shaman. Alright, we got we're forty-five percent now, so we'll see what this gives. Let's see if I can get snare on him. There we go. So forty-five. Forty-seven. That's not bad at all. They drop a bunch of junk. That's tribute. Okay. Greed that. Roll. That looks like fine steel. We don't want that. That's a quest item. Don't want that. That's an aug. That is a nice aug too. Seven AC. We're gonna take that for ourselves. Leave that on the corpse. Perfect. I don't really want to fight three of those at once. But I think that's what we'll have to do. Let's go ahead and snare that one. Slow that one. Switch to this one. Slow that one. Come on. There we go. He's slowed. Don't care about him anymore. There's a fourth. Somehow there's always a fourth. Go ahead and uh, do that. Snare slowed. Slow this one too, please. There we go. All right, let's go back over here. Let's go try snare again. And we just pull up one and kill it. Go this 3% per, so I mean, it's not bad. I just can't pull off this cleric. Save my life. Oh, you know what? I lost darkness. <laughs> cool. I call it darkness, but it's it's voice. A uh, shard of phosphorescence power. That's nice. Let's take that. Send that there. All right, we got another ad of some sort. Deal with that here in a second. All right. Heal yourself, Shaman. What is that?
Um, so Hero's Journey is a, uh, a good question. I would say, if you haven't played in a while, go for it. So... Harm touch. Let's just melt this stuff real quick. Um, like, uh, like some of the best gear you're gonna get. What what server are you playing on first? I I, I might have, you probably said, but I forgot. Are you going for like a free trade server like Verona Vi, or are you going for uh, uh, a normal uh, a normal server? So on Ferona Valley, you know, you do get the option, right, of getting gear easier. Um, but I would still think the hero's journey is probably going to be very good, unless you're going to, like, buy a lot, a lot of, buy Chrono and, you know, buy gear. Uh, so I would say go through the progression part of the hero's journey. Hey, uh, Novix, uh, 78, how are you doing this evening? I would go through the progression part here because it's going to reward you gear along the way and doing all these quests is going to reward you with gear and stuff too. Um, and then optionally, you can go into the other ones and pick up the gear there. Uh, I think if you go down here to, uh, da -da, which, oh, which one was it? I can't see them yet, but there's Paragons and Heroes gear that is really good. And I'm a staunch supporter of doing those quest lines to get the to get that gear. Alright, so what is our weakest link here? Cloak. We have intricate shor shoulders. I guess that's where we're going with this. Intricate our elaborate shoulders. Swap those out. Uh, what do you need? I don't think you need any of this, do you? Oh, that is better. Uh, it's better there, too. So, everything except the shoulders. All right, let's go with the belt. Sent back to where I sent that. And then, what are you wearing here? Your god cloak. Alright, you're getting the combat cloak. There we go. Let's see here. Let me catch up on chat. You can get your old raid count back. Chrono cell shouldn't be necessary, but a chrono or two may help down the road. Yeah, um, I, yeah, definitely. If, if if that's the the path you want to go, you you just do the tutorial, get you know refreshed on how the game works, and then uh, go wherever you want to go. Um, I think that would probably uh, work out really well for you. So we're about to hit 67. Nice, you got your monk from 38 to 44. That's really good. All right, I lost Spirit of Wolf. to another tiny terror
So I, I would say, I would say the hero's journey is tedious in Crescent's Reach, and then a few zones along the way. But the real benefit for the hero's journey is the heroes in Paragon armor towards the end, in my opinion. Unless you can can obtain easier stuff on Throne of Eye, I'm, I'm not a hundred percent sure on that right now. Uh, but that armor that you get there is as good as armor you can get till House of Thule or uh, uh, like TBM armor. And we need haste. I just can't remember where it's at. Yeah, they're uh, <laughs> they're all over the place. go and let's refocus and one more buff there we go all right looks like we're good let's go over here Another three pole. Let's grab that guy right there. Let's fall back over here. Very busy here right now. Might not be optimal for uh <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. One to fifty is fairly easy. Uh sixty-five. Yeah, I would say as soon as you can get AAs, the game really starts to speed up. There we go, 67 on just me. So that's unfortunate. I messed that up. I don't like these three poles here. I don't think there's enough mobs in this area to uh, burn a lesson. So I think we'll go uh, go somewhere else. There might be, is there anywhere else in this zone that's worth doing? Oh, let's go inside this courtyard over here. I thought we were already in there. You could uh, do like fake progression and uh, make yourself stay within a within the uh, expansions based on your level and stuff. Like I forced this group to stay in Kunark until sixty, which was uh, kind of interesting. It went way faster than I thought it would. Oh shoot. Didn't mean to do that. Sorry for them. All right. Well, <laughs> okay. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. This is a. Uh, this isn't that great of experience, I don't think. Uh, let's go over here. So we did the daily. Uh, that's really all I wanted to do here. And uh, I think we're gonna hit a different zone real quick. Uh, let me think real fast. I want to go back to. Uh, we did Halls of Honor. 
we did we did uh Bastion of Thunder. I wanna try fire, earth, and not water. Let's try fire and earth. Let's do earth or fire real quick. Uh, the hot zones are. I think there's. I think there's a level ninety something hot zone um, quest. I think. I usually stop doing them around there, uh, though, because the like early on you're getting like twenty percent of a level from uh, a single quest. Then it goes down to like ten and then five, and then just like two, even though it's like the current level. So it's just like not a whole lot of experience. <clears throat> 